Now, as Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi in South Africa is in South Africa for the BRICS summit, there is a lot of excitement among the Indian community in the country. Beyond's Alison Lagrange interacted with some of them at Hotel Sun in the Sandston city where Prime Minister Modi is due to arrive. Here are some of the excerpts from there. We are coming to you from just outside the Santon Sun Hotel where Prime Minister Modi is expected to reach any minute from now. I am standing with Pranav and Javangi who are going to be attending the Indian Diaspora Meet. What are your thoughts and feelings on Prime Minister Modi being in South Africa and the expectations of this summit? Well, first of all, as an Indian, we all love PM Modi. He is our hero and especially this is BRICS. We are based in South Africa from 12 years. We are small entrepreneurs. We are importers of spices, rice and millets. According to PM Modi, in 2023 is the international year of millet. So it has been proven for small entrepreneurs like us such a, you know, it has been such a beneficial thing that our imports of millet has been grown by 30%. So what does Prime Minister Modi being in South Africa mean to you? I don't have words to say that uh, I am like a part of this big event. It's a long, long years we wait and then finally we're going to meet Mr. Modi. When I was a small child, uh, his uh, older uh, elder brother was my neighbor. I met him personally. That time I was a very small child. And now, this age, I'm going to meet him again. How are you? I'm good and you. Namaste. Namaste. Sabona. <laughs> okay, see who? I am very happy to be here. 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 Thank you for speaking to us here on WeOn. Um, it's a pleasure. What are your expectations of this uh, address by Prime Minister Modi and what does it mean to you for Prime Minister Modi to be here in South Africa? Look, strong relationship between two countries. Okay, It should be a good tie between two countries. That is our first and final expectation. And we can change and exchange the expertise between yeah. two countries. And then it will, it will go, it's going to boom. <laughs> you know that. Yes. <laughs> I'm very excited to meet Prime Minister Modi or actually see him. I hope I get lucky enough to meet him. Um, I think one of the questions that I would like to ask him is how South Africa can actually learn from India um, with India being an economic powerhouse. I'm again Neelam Acharya. I'm part of this all the Gujarati group from Malbro and we are super excited. Har Har Modi. Hi, my name is Madhvi Sundarji. I'm actually from Rajkot, so I relate to Modi ji so, so much. And we are so excited, super, super excited to meet him. And we've got a lot of expectations. And we hope South Africa and India and the BRICS overall uh, form a nice tie together. And we progress together and we, you know, reach heights. We are here from Rajasthan Association and uh, it's a great day. It's a big day for us. It's, uh, it's a great opportunity for all of the Indian diaspora here in South Africa to meet with Mr. Modi himself. Um, and we feel privileged that he is paying us a visit after so much, after 2016. And uh, as India and South Africa both are the growing nations, it, it definitely is going to help both the nations take it to the next level.